It's a dark night in Crisp County, Georgia. <laughs> Deputy Stephen Rankin pulls over a driver for blasting his stereo. About two o'clock in the morning, I wanted to stop the car simply just to tell him to turn the music down. So it was extremely loud. What gets me is he stops in the middle of the road. And I suspect a possible DUI. The man isn't drunk. He's career criminal Ben Westbrook, and he has a gun in his lap. Rankin approaches the car. I never saw it coming. All I see is a blast. My face went completely numb. I basically blacked out. My initial thought was I, I died, that was it. Westbrook steps out to finish the job, but his gun locks up. He gets frustrated and starts pistol whipping me in the head, kicking me in the upper body. It was like a wake-up call. As Rankin fights to stay conscious, the felon gives up on his weapon. He knows there's another one nearby. I felt the tug on the side of my belt. I knew that he was grabbing for my gun. I roll over to protect my gun. He was intent on trying to kill me any way possible. I got up as fast as I could and uh, run to my car, pulled my gun out. I wanted him dead right then. <laughs> 16 rounds in our blocks, and I shot 16 of them at him. 15 of them hit the car, but none of them actually hit him. As the suspect races away, the deputy collapses, slowly choking to death. I could feel the blood and the flesh and everything draining down into my throat. Like everything just blew up in my mouth. Several miles away, fellow officer Ben Bray is already responding to the terrifying sounds from the radio. I hear him in a scuffle. I'm not quite sure what's going on. I know something is wrong. Seconds later, Rankin's voice is heard. couldn't believe that this was actually happening and all I know to do right then is pray you know I say God please let me get to him Bray races up to the scene and comes upon a numbing sight I see blood I see teeth uh, I see his glasses he says is my face gone I, I want to know I, I can't feel my, my right side of my face only an entrance wound is visible. The real damage is hidden inside. Bullet entered in just under my nose. The top teeth on my right side of my jaw are gone. It went in between my windpipe and the main artery and hit my C1 vertebra and fractured my C1 vertebra. As medical personnel arrive, the APB goes out across the county. The would-be killer is captured the very next morning. He kept using his cell phone, and we were able to, to ping his cell phone and get his location. Westbrook is sentenced to the maximum time allowable for his attempt on the officer's life, 63 years. I definitely believe he deserves a lot more. The only way I can describe him is, is not quite human, more animal than human. Deputy Rankin makes an astonishing recovery from this stone-cold attack. A miracle that he credits to his deceased father. My father, he, he came to me that night. Um, he's been my guardian angel for about since 1994. He you know, kind of told me, you know, it's time, it's time for you to fight back.